figuring out where your or what the cause of your pain is, whether it's from a damaged peripheral nerve or from arthritis or uh, inflamed tendon can be a little bit tricky, but the system is set up to identify everything but peripheral nerve pain pretty well. Generally speaking, if you go through the process of trying to figure out where your pain's coming from and you know you see your spine surgeon and your orthopedic surgeon and the neurologist and you could do physical therapy etc cetera, etc cetera, and, and nothing works or it makes it worse you're probably dealing with peripheral nerve pain just by default by, by process of exclusion other um, clues that you can be dealing with peripheral nerve pain are things like if you're experiencing numbness tingling pins and needles sensation, loss of sensation, um, weakness in, in just a, a limb rather than in your whole body, weird symptoms like feeling like there's a band around your leg or pressure or water's running down your leg. Nerve pain often will have a burning characteristic to it, so you might feel like your leg's on fire or what have you. Those kind of strange sensations often indicate a nerve problem. Another good indicator is the severity of the pain. Pain from a damaged nerve is usually off the charts bad in a lot of cases. The patient can be sitting there and look pretty normal, but can be experiencing excruciating pain. So all these things kind of give, give you a clue that you're probably dealing with a, with a nerve issue.